Hey guys, so I'm back today and I wanted to make a video that had to do with all the products and things that I actually had been liking a lot, a lot, a lot. So I'm going to go over a few of them and they're not too many, but I just really wanted to share with you guys. So I want to start with this lotion. It's called um, Shia Moisture. And this one, it says that it does anti-aging, hydrating, and rejuvenating. And I found this one at the drugstore. Um, I don't know. Like I've seen like these kind of products um, at Target. I've seen them at Walmart and Walgreens. If you have like any Walgreens around, they have these. And I don't remember how much this one was, but I would say it was maybe eight dollars. They're kind of pricey, but it really, really does what it what it says. Like it's amazing. And the most amazing thing about these products, I've talked about it before, with the shampoo and conditioners. Um, it's super natural. Like it tells you on the side that it has like nothing that's going to damage your skin or your hair. So it's amazing. And um, now that the fall is getting closer and the winter and all of that, my skin gets like extra, extra dry. Like it gets really, really dry and annoying and I start itching and all of that. So I think this is an amazing product and um, I did use it during the summer and all of that. But like as much as I used it, I don't know if you guys can see, but there's actually like enough still in there. Like This is a very concentrated lotion. And I love that. Like, I don't even know how long this is going to last me because I've used enough of it and it's still, like, a lot left still. And it smells good. Like, it just it doesn't have a strong smell. It, I would say it has, like, a natural light smell. I can't compare it to, like, a body, uh, what is it, a bad, a, a bed, bath, and beyond kind of product or a Bath and Body Work product or Victoria's Secret product. Like, no, this has a its own smell. I can't, it has like a sweet, I guess I would say sweet smell. Let me see if it says anything of like a smell that I may have here. And I can't really get the... But all I know is that it has a really, really good smell. So it's not going to make you like sick, like if you have, like don't like strong smells and stuff like that. But I can't compare it to like a fruit, I don't think. Yeah, it's like no fruit that really smells like that. But yeah, it smells like lotion. I don't know. So it kind of smells like baby lotion, but it still has something else mixed to it. But I really, really like it. And I would really recommend this. Um, and I love it. Like, I put it on my feet. I, you put it anywhere on your body, and it really does its own thing. Like, it's amazing. See, it says elbows, knees, it, um, the, on the heels, and it really, really, see, it says it concentrates on rough and dry areas. So, it's really amazing. So, you guys should really try it, and maybe give me your own comments if you already do have it. But I really love all their products. So, yeah, so I, I do use this kind of brand. I also wanted to share that another thing that I've been using a lot in the summer and now that the fall is coming as well. This is an awesome um, body wash. It deep, it's a deep moisture and it nourishes body wash, nourishing body wash. And it's amazing. Oh my gosh, I already got some on my finger. I don't have to just, oh, give me a minute. So I'm back. So yeah, so I just like literally like took this out of my shower. But yes, and I love it and it doesn't have a strong smell as well. Not that I have anything against strong smells, but I like this and it really, and it, it smells really clean. It actually reminds me of another lotion. Like it, it's like a, ba a, like a baby lotion kind of thing. And I like it and it really does what it says. It really leaves my skin softer and smoother. And I like it the way it is it's so weird because normally when you take a shower you get like that like bubbly um thing from like any kind of wash this one doesn't this one's more of like it looks literally like a lotion so when you get it out it looks just like lotion it's the most weirdest thing ever 
See, I don't know if you guys can see, but it really, really reminds me of a lotion bottle. And um, it's amazing. And I like it. And I feel clean afterwards. And yeah, I like it. So that's one of my other products that I love. Another Dove product that I have is this um, Clinical Protection. And it's the um, deodorant. And this one is pretty clear. Like, you just put it on and it has like these little holes on the top and you kind of scroll and it the little white stuff comes out and when you literally put it on like you don't see it like in the beginning you might see like the white of it but then it just kind of like disappears so and i like it because it really has helped with a lot of stuff so yeah and it smells good it also has a light smell to it and i like the way it works for me. I don't know. Everyone's different. I know that my cousin, she can't use this for certain reasons. Um, so, you know, it all depends with what makes you feel comfortable. But this is something I really, really, really do love. And if you like the Dove product, I would really recommend for you to try this one. If you haven't yet. Oops. There we go. Alright. So, I want to share also. And I've seen a lot of people on YouTube that have used um, these products. And I decided to just go ahead and try it. And I must say, I love it. I was using the Olay um, makeup remover wipes. Um, and I have nothing against it. I really do like it. But I was using it for a really long time. And I was like, you know what? I need to try something new. And now I'm using this one. And I really, really like it. When you take it out, it's like pretty long. <coughs> it's like long like this. Believe it or not. I don't know if you guys have tried it. It's like this long and it really like takes everything away. The reason I actually changed to um, this wipe, like even though the one of Olay kept saying that it was sensitive, this one, the other one was kind of like burning my under eye. I don't know why, maybe because I was using it for too long. I don't know. This one, when I use it, I really don't feel any stinging in my eyes, nothing. It really takes my, my eye makeup. It takes everything and I really, really like it. So together with that... I actually got the daily facial cleanser as well and I'm I'm loving it I really am loving it I wanted to find like a, a face wash you know besides the one that I'm using for my whole body I wanted to do something that was going to actually be just for my face and this one I really do like if you guys haven't used it it comes out really clear and it works fine and I've been using it day and night and it's been doing good so Another of my favorite products I really do like. And I haven't gotten any, like, like reaction. Like, I have really sensitive skin. So, thank God that one hasn't given me any type of crazy-ass reaction. So, yes. Now, um, I also wanted to share. This is amazing. Um, I've been using this for months. Months, 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 months. And this is the Olay Total Effects. And it's 7-in-1. And it's um, an anti-aging night firming treatment and it does a bunch of stuff in one <coughs> i lost the box i don't know where it's at but it does a bunch of stuff in one and this is how it looks like i don't remember how much it was but i know that i did get it from walmart they have so many different things with for olay but i really like this one and it has like that olay smell to it and i haven't gotten any like um, re like bad reaction from it either and I put it under my eyes I put it all over my face my neck before I go to sleep so this is something that I do use for my night routine I wash my face with the um the face wash and all of that and then before I, I hit the bed I place this in my face so I do like that now since I show you my day lotion I wanted to show you guys my I mean, my night lotion, I wanted to show you my day one. Um, this is something that I use for under my eyes. It's the Aveeno Active Naturals. And it's a, it's a lifting and firming eye cream. And it's really small. It's like literally like the size of like a lipstick. This is a 0.5 ounce. Yeah. So it's really small like this, but... I do like it because for some reason, 
I was like having a lot of dry issue under my eye and like red and blah, 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 blah. So I ended up going to the doctor, eye doctor. And I was like, what's going on with my, under my eyes? And she was like, I don't know. Are you like, did you change like the solution of your contacts? So and so and so. I said, no. So she was like, well, it just seems really dry. So just put some kind of like lotion on it, moisturize it. Blah, 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 blah. So I went and grabbed this because I really trust Avino. And so, yeah, so I got this eye cream. And let me tell you, once you put it on, you do feel the tightness and the firming under the eyes. And I have seen a difference. So I do like this. And, yeah, so that's something that I use all the time and I love. <coughs> I also would like to share. I think I've done already, um, what's that called? Uh, makeup tutorial with these but I am like just in love I wanted to share it one more time I love to use this L'Oreal true match concealer and it's amazing I use the light medium w45 color and this is how it is and if most of you haven't used it this is how it looks like literally looks like a crown and that's how it is and I don't take it out like that I use like this a little bit like that and I just go ahead and put it under my eye or even like around like anywhere I feel like I need it any blemishes I use it and it's amazing so I use that but now I also love this right here this is the brand Maybelline New York and it's a highlighting concealer let me tell you people this is amazing when you open it up, it's like this brush right here. I don't know. I'm trying to make sure that's going to focus on what I'm showing you guys. And yeah, so it has like a little brush and you just twist this and the concealer goes up. Right now, I don't really have much, right? I think. Ooh. But yes, this is amazing. And this, I think I did have it in my um hippie tutorial. I don't know. But yes, this I usually put it under my eyes, so I don't use both of them together. I used to, and now I'm like, why did I do that? But whatever. But yes, this one is amazing. Like, it really, really conceals, like, everything. So I put it right here, like, in a triangle shape under my eye. And I just keep tapping it and tapping it and tapping it. And I go even around, like, my eyelids and everything like that. It's amazing. And yeah, so I've been using that and it's like a creamy kind of conceal when this comes up. Literally, it really is. It's amazing. I don't know if it has any on it right now. Yep, it does. I'm going to get up so you guys can see. So pretty much, this is what you will see. It's like a liquid type of um, concealer. I don't know if it's focusing or not. But yes, it's a really good, good kind. I really do like it. So yeah, so this is the brush, and that is the brand, and I am just in love with this, and oops, I'm like walking on my knees. <laughs> you guys are probably like, why are you on your knees? I don't know. I just feel like doing this on the floor today. But yeah, so I really do like this. I don't remember how much it was, but I did, I did get it from Walmart as well. Both of them. I did. Both. So, one more thing I want to share. You guys gotta excuse me. I'm still going through this whole cold thing. I needed one of uh, the um, speakers for a baby shower that I was um, doing. And um, I couldn't, I didn't know what where to go, where to find one. And let me tell you, this right here is amazing. Amazing speaker. I am in love with this. Like, I thought I was going to regret it because not all speakers are really good and amazing and stuff like that. This is a wireless speaker, and this is how it looks like. And it sounds great. It literally sounds like you have good big speakers, like a big speaker. So, we, this is what we used, and back here it has the aux in, and um, there's a speaker thing here, whatever you want to call it. But, yeah, it's, it's really easy to um to just pair and you call that my cup pairing it to your phone it's so so easy and it cost me like 34 dollars at walmart right walmart yes walmart i was actually shocked and so yeah so i got it and i love it and i wouldn't change it for anything 
and it's so small and you can just take it with you anywhere and so yeah so you guys if you guys are looking for some kind of speaker bluetooth kind of thing this is the way to go i really do like it and if you don't have your phone you can go ahead and use somebody else's that's what we did in that party like so my phone doesn't die so someone else will go ahead and do it and it just it's amazing this is something you really should get into just if you don't have like any speakers or you're just over those big big speakers or those battery speakers this is not battery so yeah it's amazing so i just wanted to share with you my little favorite collection here this is something that i literally use like all the time and i am in love with my favorite 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 thing so I hope you guys enjoy and thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye.